is so cool. I was sitting here editing and birds were just like flipping out. And then when I yelled at them, they still didn't stop. And I saw that hawk man. I wonder how much of that is going on all the time in the world, but we just have no idea that it's going on. Like there's this battle of life and death in the animal world that we know nothing of. It is a beautiful day in the neighborhood. I'm having cold pizza for breakfast, so to speak. Mm. Oh baby. No, I thought coffee was my true love. It's actually pizza. So when it comes to making videos, there's two things that I pride myself on. One is taking interview footage of somebody rambling, stuttering, and repeating themselves, and turning it into something that's not only intelligible, but actually fun to watch. And just in case you didn't know, everybody rambles, stutters, and repeats themselves constantly. You just don't realize it because your brain filters it out. But second, I'm also very proud of my ability to take something that is completely uninteresting and mundane and make it something that is actually watchable. With that being said, I'm now gonna do my laundry. These vlogs are of course much more interesting and fun to watch when I'm in an interesting location or have interesting stuff to do. But I find it a very fulfilling creative practice to make something like this actually semi-entertaining to watch. But this morning I found a YouTube channel with 55,000 subscribers and the only thing it is is a guy walking around, he doesn't talk, he doesn't show his face, he just points the camera forward and walks around Japan. And Brian said to me, if you lived in Japan for six months, your vlog would probably be huge. And I was like, you know, I've thought about that before, but maybe I should actually give that some serious thought and just find somebody I can like rent a place out from for like two or three months, do literally nothing but explore, grow the vlog, and then go back home and do my laundry every day and watch everybody <laughs> unsubscribe. I didn't subscribe for laundry. I subscribe for Japan, which is a very real possibility of how it would go. So if Adventure Archives is walking and talking, the vlog is laundry and trash. Guys, it is just one of those busy, not enough time in the day days today. Nonetheless, the time for the Zumba class has come. Let us go. Do that. Okay, uh, I will be back. Cheers to that. Pretty good. Had pizza with my sister. And then I ate a bowl of kicks. I have not had a bowl of cereal in such a long time. And kicks are so good. Kid tested, mom approved indeed. I could eat that day and night. And day and night. That's why I can't keep that stuff in my house. Well, getting real sick of how hot it is in my house all the time. Hopefully, summer will be over soon. But thank you for watching today's vlog. I'll see you tomorrow. Guys, it is just one of those busy, not enough time in the days.